and welcome to Cookie Corner with Giuseppe Grimaldi. Tonight, on our episode for you, we're going to be making squash spaghetti. Giuseppe, wait. Spaghetti squash, right? Not squash spaghetti. Spaghetti squash? Well then, that's something else entirely, isn't it? Tonight, we'll be making spaghetti squash. So now that we've uh, figured out which dish we're making here, that is, spaghetti squash and not squash spaghetti, Let's go over the ingredients. You're gonna need one spaghetti squash. You're gonna need salt and pepper. You're gonna need little grape tomatoes. You're gonna need mozzarella pearls. You're gonna need minced garlic and some basil. And of course, you're gonna need some olive oil. So in terms of hardware for this dish, you're gonna need the following. You're gonna need a medium to large frying pan. You're gonna need a large knife. You're gonna need both a spoon and a fork. You're gonna need a measuring spoon. You're gonna need some tongs. You're gonna need a cutting board and a baking sheet. And of course, you're gonna need some aluminum foil. As always, folks, step number one is going to be wash your pants. You heard me right, folks. Just get yourself a dirty pair of pants. Start running some water over them. Get them nice and moist. You want to get all that water into the pants themselves. Grab some of that dish soap. Get them right on that pants. You want to get all the stains out. All those grease stains in your pants, so you got to wash them out. It's the only way to get all those stains out. Get the dish soap. Kind of wring out your pants a little bit. Oh yeah, that's some good stuff right there. Turn the water off, you can grab the pants, kind of wring them out a little bit. That's the good stuff right there. Gotta get some more water on these bad boys, they're, they're very soapy. <laughs> Once you convince your pants are nice and clean, grab yourself a nice little hanger. Clip them on, and you can hang them up to dry. As always, step number one, wash your pants. Now is a good time to preheat your oven. You've got to preheat your oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. Do that now. Moving right along, we're on to step number two. And step number two is going to be prepare your squash. Now, the first part of this is going to be cutting your squash in half, hot dog style. What that means is, stand the squash upright and cut down vertically. Now this is not going to be an easy task, so be very careful when doing this. You want to get as clean of a split as you can. Could have gone better, could have gone worse. Now your squash is in half. What you're gonna do is scoop out all those delicious insides and get rid of them. What I'm talking about is all the stuff that looks like the inside of a pumpkin, garbage. All the seeds, all the, like, the dangly bits, you don't need any of that. So using this spoon, just scrape that stuff out and get rid of it. operation. Moving right along folks, once you get all those nasty innards out of your spaghetti squash, what you're going to do is add a tablespoon of olive oil, a teaspoon of pepper, and a teaspoon of salt to each half of your spaghetti squash. Alright? Now do that.
Now that you've got your squash all covered in salt, pepper, and oil, you're going to stick this in the oven for 40 to 45 minutes at 400 degrees Fahrenheit. Alright, let's put it in. Moving right along folks, we're on to step number three. And step number three is going to be cook your garlic and your tomatoes in your pan. So what you're going to do is add a tablespoon of olive oil to your pan. Then you're going to add one and a half teaspoons of garlic and one cup of halved cherry tomatoes. Stick them in your pan, turn them over high heat, and cook them until they're done. Alright, let's get to it. Once you've sautéed your garlic and tomatoes for about 5 minutes, you're done and you're ready to move on to the next step. It's been about 40 minutes, so it's time to take out the spaghetti squash and move on to the next step. Moving on to step number 4, it's going to be shred your spaghetti squash. So, what you're going to do is take a fork, a large fork, a small fork, it doesn't really matter, just a fork, and you're going to shred the inside of your spaghetti squash. Now what I mean by that is carefully, because it's still hot, hold the pan and the squash and grab it with your fork and pull it towards you. And it will shred just like spaghetti. Once you've shredded the inside of your spaghetti squash, you can put your fork down, grab your tongs and pull all that spaghetti squash into the pan with your tomatoes. Once you've got all your stringy spaghetti squash bits into your pan, you're going to mix it all up and then you put it all back into the squash shell. Once you've re-stuffed your tomatoes, garlic, and spaghetti squash back into the spaghetti squash shell, you're going to top it with a little bit of basil and some mozzarella pearls. And then it's going to go back in the oven. Now that you've got your squash shells restuffed, it's time for step number five, which is going to be put it back in the oven for five to ten minutes at 400 degrees. Now that it's been that extra five minutes, it's time to check in the spaghetti squash and if it's done, take it out. Let's have a look-see, shall we? Oh, it smells delicious. Oh, it looks delicious. I think it's time to take it out and get a taste to see if it tastes delicious. Oh, yeah. It's time to move on to the final step. Alright, everybody, it's time for the final step, which is going to be plating. So, get yourself some tongs and make sure they work. Perfect. Now you're going to grab the side of the pan with a towel or something heat resistant so you don't burn yourself. Get yourself a nice tongue full of the spaghetti squash. Get the tomatoes, get the mozzarella, get the whole nine yards. And put that right in the middle of your plate. That is looking delicious. All right, everyone, that concludes this week's episode of Cooking Corner with Giuseppe Crimiroli. I hope you like the spaghetti squash recipe. If you do, I've got a few others I'd like to try out, so let me know in the comments. If you like this video, leave a like on it. If there's something you want to see on the channel, let me know, and I'll look into making it for the rest of the show. All right, uh, bye-bye now. We're making spaghetti squash, right? Not squash spaghetti. Spaghetti squash. Now that's something else entirely. Today we'll be making spaghetti squash.